So you talked about your cool things. You talked about that network of people how it kind of started to build up. You say you were shy at first, and then you know you sent it to someone. They sent it to someone else. Who are some other people in your support networks that uh, you've relied on, that you trust in, um, who've helped build you up through your career? Um, yeah, early on it was my friends. You know, like. And I tell people that a lot. You when you when you doing something or you trying to do something, you should. It's okay with like starting off small or thinking small because one person turned into ten people and you know and then it turned into a hundred and so on and so forth. But early on, it was like my friends just pushing me to go to the studio and sit in the studio. Like my mom was kind of strict growing up. She used to want me in the house early and stuff like that. But my friends like, no, you got to finish this song. So I was breaking curfew coming in the house at 1 a.m. and stuff like that, and my parents didn't really, like, understand, but I'm like, no, nah, I'm trying to rap, you feel me? And they started to understand, like, as they saw that I was taking it serious and, you know, not trying to be in the streets and actually wanting to be in the studio. And when I got more serious, I met my partner, who I'm still in business with right now, uh, JB, and I met Mick, Mickey Halston. Um, and, you know, they saw something in me when I was a 16-year-old kid that I didn't even see in myself. And for them to believe in me and, you know, and still like knowledge from a adult's perspective. You know, I didn't really have a lot of role models and people I looked up to and they 20 plus years older than me, both of those guys. So I got like a lot of knowledge and insight from them and still, you know, 10, 12 years later, they still pushing me, you know, in my career, they still behind me. I'm still in business with the same people, you know, so it's important to have a team around you and, and build off of that. And, and it's, it's important to be unselfish, you know, for me to, you know, build them so they could, Elevate and you know um, evolve as 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 managers, CEOs. You know what I'm saying the case may be, and I evolve as an artist. So it got to be a, a mutual line of interest. You know, we all interested in the same thing. Me blowing to become a, a global superstar and, and and building a brand at the same time. So yeah, I, I'm fortunate to have like you know people in my life that believe in me and instill, you know, these things in me where I don't want to quit. You know, these people wake up and they on the emails on the phone, 6, 7 a.m. And, you know, I'm getting up, going to the studio. We all working towards the same goal and it make me want to work harder because I see people around me wanting to work just as hard. That's awesome. Um, I, I love that.